hey guys welcome back to the channel on today's video we are going to be looking at a disease hepatitis before we ride on please those who are visiting the channel for your first time please do hit the subscribe button and turn on your notification so whenever i upload a video you'll be the first to know about it on today's video we are going to take a look at the following what is hepatitis types of hepatitis how can hepatitis be diagnosed symptoms of hepatitis how hepatitis can be prevented and the effects of untreated hepatitis so what is hepatitis hepatitis refers to the inflammation of the liver which might be caused by the virus toxins drugs alcohol consumption or an autoimmune disorder Looking at the various types of hepatitis, we have three main types of hepatitis. The viral hepatitis, the autoimmune hepatitis, and the hepatitis caused by alcohol and other toxins. Let's take a look at the various types of viral hepatitis. We have five different types of viral hepatitis. Hepatitis A, Hepatitis B, Hepatitis C, Hepatitis D and E. Let's take a look into Hepatitis A. Hepatitis A is caused by the Hepatitis A virus. It is usually caused by consuming food and drinks contaminated with the feces of an infected person. Let's take a look at Hepatitis B. It is transmitted through contact with infectious body fluid such as blood, vagina secretion, or semen containing the hepatitis B virus. Injection drug use, having unprotected sex with an infected partner, or sharing razors with an infected person increases your risk of getting hepatitis B. Thirdly, we have hepatitis C, which comes from the hepatitis C virus and is transmitted through direct contact with infected body fluids, typically through injection drug use and sexual contact. Hepatitis D is caused by the hepatitis D virus and only affects people who are already infected with hepatitis B. This is because hepatitis D needs the hepatitis B virus to be able to survive in the body. It is usually spread through blood to blood contact or sexual contact. Long term infection. Hepatitis E is a waterborne disease caused by the hepatitis E virus. It is also associated with the consumption of raw or undercooked pork meat, wild bow meat, and shellfish. Apart from the viral hepatitis, there exist other various types of hepatitis, one of them which happens to be alcoholic hepatitis. Alcoholic hepatitis is a type of hepatitis caused by drinking excessive amounts of alcohol over many years. Other toxic causes of hepatitis include overuse or overdose of medications and we also have autoimmune hepatitis which is a type of hepatitis in which the immune system attacks and damages the liver. Some of the symptoms of hepatitis include muscles and joint pain, high temperature, pale gray colored food, unexplained weight loss, yellowing of the eye and skin, dark urine, loss of appetite, fatigue, and itchy skin. Hepatitis can be diagnosed through one of the following ways. Firstly, we have the liver function test, which make use of liver enzymes. High liver enzymes level may indicate that your liver is stressed, damaged, or not functioning properly. Another method of diagnosis is by ultrasound. Ultrasound can reveal fluids in your abdomen, liver enlargement, liver tumor, and abnormalities of the gallbladder. 
Thirdly, we have liver biopsy. Biopsy allows the doctor to determine how infection or inflammation has affected the liver. Untreated hepatitis can lead to one of the following conditions. It can lead to cirrhosis, that is scarring of the liver. It can lead to liver cancer as well as liver failure. How can hepatitis be prevented? Hepatitis can be prevented by getting vaccinated, avoid drinking alcohol, avoid sharing needles to take drugs, practice good personal hygiene, and use of condom during sex. The various backgrounds in the video were selected to ease understanding. The backgrounds with respect to viral hepatitis had the structures of the various viral hepatitis. Thanks for watching and don't forget to drop your comment in the comment box below. Please do not forget to subscribe and turn on your notification so whenever we upload a video, you'll be the first to know about it.